Hello beautiful people, my name is Bridget and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing something I haven't done in a long time because I have insecurities. Today we're doing a dress video. I have a whole bunch of black dresses here from Dress Lily. I've been wearing the same three dresses. I mean if you see my vlogs and stuff you kind of know. You can probably see that I'm wearing the same thing constantly because I just have a couple dresses that I just cycle through. Okay, I don't like trying on dresses. I don't like trying on clothes. It scares me the idea of having to buy pants one day which is just terrifying to me. I don't like trying clothes because I have a lot of insecurities. But today we're gonna break out of my comfort zone. We're gonna do it anyways because I really need new things to wear. So these are all dress lily black dresses. That's what I chose because that's what I wear. <laughs> and I picked some that are more cutesy and some that look more comfortable. So we have a good mix today. I am gifted these in exchange for showing them to you, but I'm not paid. If they suck, I'll tell you they suck and all that good jazz. I really just needed some new clothes. So. That's what we're trying today, and hopefully you guys will enjoy it, and hopefully I won't, like, hate myself after watching me edit this, you know? Okay, so this is the first dress. This is the one I fell in love with on the website. It just happened to be the first one I pulled out of the bag. This has a very, um, well, my black background isn't helping. Hold on, let me rearrange you. Never mind my dirty house, okay? I'm just trying to show you the dress without like the black in the background. This is the silhouette. It's very comfortable material. It's right over my knee, so it's a little bit longer. This has a really pretty neckline and this little bow here. I wish the neckline was a little tighter. I have it zipped all the way up. This is very loose on me. I feel like this is very loose. I can see my bra straps, which really I don't care because I'm an adult. Anybody who cares like, ooh, I can see your bra straps, you know, grow up. <laughs> I do not care about that whatsoever. But I do feel like this is a little bit loose on me. If I had more stuff to fill it out, it'd probably fit perfectly. Overall, though, I will wear this. It looks really cute, and it's really comfortable. Like, my arms are free. The chest and everything isn't too tight. And also, I have made the executive decision, unlike my other try-on hauls, I'm not wearing shapewear today. Usually, I wear shapewear, so in the video, I look as small as can be, and I look really sucked in and everything. I've made the executive decision not to wear shape today. Wear today, I'm just wearing a loose... Uh, regular light panty because I wanted to show you my actual body <laughs> so on a normal day I'm not gonna wear shapewear because it's too freaking hot outside for that so I wanted to show you what it looked like on an average day look isn't black kind of slimming though the back of it's really cute yeah it's cute I'm a little bit insecure about my arms but not enough to care you know like I like this kind of dress because it's hot outside I don't want to wear like everything all the time you know, every time I order stuff in a large, it's too small. Every time I order something in an extra large, it's too big. Why am I the perfect in-between of those two sizes? Because that one could have been a little tighter, and so could this one. I ordered everything in an extra large because usually when I order large, it's just too tight. So I went with the extra large. But this dress, so it has the same like right over the knee kind of length. I got it because it had this cute harnessy looking strappiness. And I like these too. They're really cute. This is a little loose for me. I wish I could adjust the straps on it to be a little bit tighter up because I don't have enough uh, stuff here to fill this dress out to make it the prettiest possible. Very, very thin. It's a little see-through when you like looked at it. Like I picked it up to try it on and I was in front of a window, I could see through it. On me, I don't think it's see-through hopefully, but I do like it. Like I, I just wanna, like maybe I could stitch on the top here and like pinch it higher. I just wish it was a little uh, tighter up, up here so I don't feel like I gotta like expose myself while I lean over. However, it is so thin and like a t-shirt material that it is very comfortable. Some people may say the thin material is a downside, but like it's really comfortable. So this is another win for me. I just need to make an adjustment in this area. In theory, this was supposed to be one of the cutest ones, and I do not like it. This is a cute velvety material. It has this cute belt. Everything here, flowy, soft, easy, comfortable, which is what I wanted. It's fine. This situation is unflattering. Like, look at me from the side. This does nothing for my shape. Like, it grabs me in all the wrong places. It should grab me under here, and it doesn't, you know? The straps are way too big. Like, they're way too big. This is my bra. This is the straps that come with the dress. They're way too big. They're not adjustable, which sucks. Like, if they could be pinched in the back, that would be ideal. But this is just not the greatest fit right here. 
even if I pull it back and try to like move the straps down my back, it's not, it's not a good fit. Um, this one's going to be a no because of the straps. However, this material, again, so comfortable and I like the cute belt. It's just not very flattering up here. Okay, here's the length on this one, a little longer in the back. Um, it's kind of like this asymmetrical deal. This one I got because I was like, what if I don't want to stand out in a crowd? What is the most like, still a black dress, but looks kind of like Florida everyday casual attire. This one has this cute, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a cute little ruffle right here. And it kind of just folds this kind of skirt thing down. It looks really cute. This with a really dramatic necklace, like a long, dangly, beautiful, blood red dripping necklace would be so cute. I don't have a necklace like that, but I could. This is cute. It's elasticy. I feel like it, it does hug my stomach and stuff, which I am the most insecure about in the world. But like it doesn't enhance the little pooch or anything. So this one's a win. It's again, so comfortable. I, I guess I was picking things without any arms or like sleeves on them because a lot of my dresses I don't wear because they have beautiful, long, dramatic bat wing sleeves or mesh sleeves. And I love those. But sometimes it's just too hot. But this one looks good. Like it makes my chest look nice. Everything looks right and tight. This one's good. And I'm not even wearing shapewear and I feel confident about my stomach getting touched by a piece of fabric. That's a win. <laughs> Okay, so this is the next one. Again, right at knee length on this one. This, I kind of just slightly knotted behind my head because just straps. Um, I don't know how I feel about this one. It fits fine on my sides. Doesn't make me look too poochied, <laughs> you know? However, I feel like the this isn't the most flattering, and these are very loose on my arms. Like, I feel like they should be tighter to stay where they're at. I feel like they're just rolling up and down my arms when I move my arms. So those sleeves are a little uncomfortably loose. I want them to like hug my arm a little bit so I don't feel like they're going everywhere. Um, I don't think it's terrible. Again, elasticy fabric, it feels nice. But uh, yeah, the sleeves bother me, I think. I think this like being so hanging off my arm is, is kind of odd. All right, this next dress is basically a giant long sleeve t-shirt. I, I don't know. I guess maybe I thought with a cute belt, this would look cute, like cinch or something. I don't know why I chose this. It feel, It's like silky material, so I feel like I'm wearing a giant nightgown or I'm like a nun or something. I don't know. I'm not a fan of this. I mean, the dress itself is fine. The quality is fine. I just don't think the shape is for me. Um, this is how I dress at home. Just a big giant baggy t-shirt, usually with short sleeves. <laughs> like you saw in the beginning of this video. This feels comfortable, but I, I don't think I go out in public like this. People are gonna think I'm wearing a nightgown. I was so hoping I would like this one, truly, because I love black and white. I love black and white checkerboard. I wasn't allowed to have anything checkerboard growing up because um, it was too edgy or too tacky. So as an adult, I fully embrace my love of checkerboard and black and white. And I really, I want this dress to be cute on me. I really do. I feel like it should probably, like, because it's, it's just loose enough where it doesn't hug me. Like, this, and then my shape is actually this. I feel like it's just loose enough where it doesn't hug me, where it looks like it's just a little too big for me. These straps, again, very loose. When I first put it on, my dress was like this, which, I mean, I guess is a look in itself. This is like, like elastic elastic, which I don't mind. I think it's fun. I'm not sure it's the most flattering, but I still want to love it. I still want to love it just because it's like in concept, it's the cutest dress. Should it be tighter? Maybe, but if it's tighter, would I feel uncomfortable about my stomach? You know, this one's a maybe because I really love the pattern. Also, I like this little like round thing with the elastic strap on it on the front but not the back like that's fun do we like this one let me know because this being a little too loose weirds me out because i feel like it was like a lot bigger it would probably look like it's supposed to be an oversized flowy moment this just looks like it's wrong and it keeps showing my bra so i don't know i want to love it let me know what you think down below this is what i'm talking about this is what i'm talking about this is like an everyday dress for me now Let's talk about it. It's a little more colorful than I wanted. It has the orange and red like jack lantern skeleton guys. The orange, I don't really like wearing color. It makes me a little uncomfortable to see color on me. I don't know why, like my hair is green. 
but colorful clothes, a little intimidating for me. This built-in belt, it's so cute. It hugs my sides perfectly and goes to onto my extraordinarily wide hips. <laughs> but uh, this, this right here, perfect fit for me. It doesn't hug my stomach too much because it's flowy. Like this is so, it's super stretchy, by the way, very comfortable. This kind of neckline, I feel like it's perfect for, you know, double accessorizing with a big necklace and big earrings because it just has so much open space. I could also put like a little capelet over it. This is perfect. I'm gonna wear this every day. Maybe I should have kept my orange for this dress. This is like, like, it's not like, oh my God, she's so skinny kind of dress. It's just like, it's comfortable. It's flattering. It's, it's comfortable. <laughs> and like, I don't have to be overly hot in this. This is nice. This is also the last one. I am also going to show you one other thing, but because of YouTube guidelines, I can't try it on for you. So I ordered a bathing suit, also in an extra large. The bottom is just a high-waisted black bottom. No skirt or anything, just a high-waisted black bottom. I need the high-waisted just to myself in a little bit if I have to wear a bathing suit. And then the top is this cute little skeletons dancing and they have their head off and they're just dancing having a good time and there's like little stars and a moon this moon was super pretty this is the top for the bathing suit that i ordered and it looks cute i haven't tried it on yet of course but it looks really cute so overall we have one maybe dress that i might like i might wear i don't think it's very flattering but fuck i love that pattern the black and white one the checkered board one sorry and then I had two that I didn't like the fit of, the one that I tied the neck on, and then the other one that was just not flattering to the, the velvet one with the thing. It just wasn't very flattering. However, all the rest of them, they're winners. This one's my favorite just because of comfortability. Like it's, I'm used to wearing a dress like this all the time, so it really works out for me. I am used to the sides being a little looser, but I like the sides being tight like this and not enhancing my stomach because it's flowy at the bottom. Like, perfect. Anyways. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you're in need of a big t-shirt, I do have my own small business, theopencrypt.com. They come in small up to 3X. 4X were out of stock. I was going to stock those too. But yeah, so thank you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm glad I have clothes to wear that don't involve giant sleeves because I love the giant sleeves. I love the drama. But like it's August <laughs> and your girl gets hot in Florida. <laughs>